Hi, it's Jess with Jess Makes Sense. And today I wanna to show you my haul video of the Ollie's, what's it called? Ollie's Bargain Outlet, I think. They have them, I believe, nationwide. So check your area and see if they have them. I never went to one, but when I went to visit my mom for her birthday, she brought me to one and I was a little reluctant to go because usually those discount stores, it's like, let's be honest, it's usually junk, right? But this one had amazing choice of books. I mean, they had so many books at such a low price that my mind was just everything else I would say regular. I get a few body care items and I'll show you that. A lot of this stuff is uh, discounted. So it'll have like Rice Krispie treats with like the uh, red and green candies on it. So that was from Christmas. So they have like discounted um food all still good there the expiration date is still good but it's just stuff that's got out of the stores that they bring to this outlet i don't know exactly how it works but they do have some good things there but i'd say the star of the show are their books and i've heard rumors about their books being good but i didn't believe it until i saw it but we'll get started with the body care really quickly i grabbed these tree hut vanilla bean bath bombs there's three of them and they're mighty big. They are pretty big guys. I think they're like 2.7.2 point, uh, ounces. It is the Tahitian vanilla bean with vanilla extract and Monoi oil. This on Amazon was like $15.73. Ollie's $4.99. I thought that was a great deal because I believe these are like if you buy them at like CVS or Walgreens, they're like six or seven dollars each. So I'd say that was a score. I also grabbed this sparkling rose from Body Fantasies. Uh, I know if you're Walmart shoppers, then you probably have had these in the past or now. This one was $1.99, which I thought was a great deal because this is the big eight ounce size. This is sparkling rose. And it does have, it's like a very rosy scent, almost bubbly, almost bubbly rosé, but I'd say like a sweeter rose than that. It smells really good. Uh, I'll probably just leave this in my car and if I need to spray, then spray and go. This is actually a men's item. It is the Men's Degree Advanced Protection Dry Spray with Juniper and Vanilla 72 Hour, which... I'd hope you'd shower this off before 72 hours. But the juniper and vanilla almost gives it like a sweet scent. So I don't know if it maybe get discontinued because men didn't pick the juniper and vanilla scent. I wish they'd come out with this in a for a woman because I think we'd really like this. But I grabbed it in the men's. This was $2.99 compared to their price of $4.99. It smells really good. I do put deodorant on, but I also like the dry spray throughout the day. If you live in Florida, you know. Next is this. This said it was $5. It was $1.49. It's Deep Sea Minerals Pure Venus Gillette Shave Cream with Shea Butter. And this was, what does that say? $1.49. And it doesn't have much of a scent, but I thought for $1.49 it was worth a try. This I don't think is the best deal. This is the Johnson Hand and Face Wipes. This is $3.99. It says their price is $5.49. But I always need these for my car, so I grab them because I just always need them. Next. That's from my house, not Ollie's. Next is this book. I like like teeny bopper books, y'all, because I like nice, nice. And I like them to be a happy ending, unless it's more like sci-fi, Hunger Games, Twilight, Harry Potter, things like that. But I don't like like war books. I don't like bio autobiographies, biographies. I just don't know why. I just, there's usually sad things about them and there's already so much sad in the world that I just don't want to read that sad. So I just usually skip them. But this is Listen to Your Heart by Casey West. I heard Casey West is really good. And so I read the little synopsis when you open the book and it looked cute. This was $2.99 compared to $17.99. $2.99 for a hardback book. Crazy. Next I get, these were also $2.99. This is Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them, The City Skyline. I thought this was really pretty, even if 
I don't love the movie Fantastic Beasts. I just like Harry Potter. I have watched it a couple times. I just don't think it's the greatest. But I did think that the skyline was really pretty. It has an owl there. And it's perfect for your car to jot down stuff because all the time I remember stuff in the car and then I have nothing to write it down with and then I forget about it. And I can't do it on my phone because I'm usually listening to a podcast and so never do. This I already have and I spent $12.99 on this. So that was correct, $12.99 compared to price and this was $2.99. This is the Harry Potter Just Little Pocket Journal and it's Hufflepuff. I get this for my sister-in-law because she is also a Hufflepuff. They did only have the Hufflepuff, um, how many times do I have to say Hufflepuff? They, did have, they didn't have any other houses, they only had this one. So if you were a Hufflepuff, you can get it at Ollie's at $2.99. I also went to Bucky's today and Ollie's and I feel like both of them like sound so country so I just feel like I should have put on my hat. Uh, this is Harry Potter Goblet of Fire Enchanted Postcard Book. It includes four moving images. It has 3D images, it's really cool. But it's just like a postcard book and I thought it was awesome. This was originally $12.99, $2.99 at Ollie's. The next, this I will if you don't see a picture in there, it didn't work out. If you do see a picture in this, like somewhere here, it's because it worked out. This is a 3.2 inch LED light strip for TV. Decor and more. I want to put it behind my TV and see if it does glow like that. It was $2.99, so I took the risk. So we will see that. I think my mom gave me that one. So that's not really this. This one is called Pray Like This, a 52-week prayer journal. This was originally $12.99, our price $3.99. And a lot of their books do come from Target. They'll have this like Target label on it or um, they're exclusive to Target items. And I know that, so I knew that they came from Target. But this one just gives you a little reading and then you can put your day one and answer the question or how you feel, or write your journal, whatever you wanna do in this. I thought that was really cute. This, I think this is the one my mom told me to get. This was originally $17. It's called The Paris Wife. It's a New York Times bestseller. So I will read this and get back to you. Next is It's Not Summer Without You by Jenny Han, bestselling author of To All the Boys Who Loved Before. This one was from Walmart, obviously, 1018. Ollie's price is $2.99. These are just quick reads that I like to. I have um, the Kindle Unlimited, and so I grab books on there and read them at night when my husband's sleeping because it has like the 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 front light, so it's not like too bright. I don't know all the terms. And then this is question of the day for couples, a three-year journal to capture like your conversations. This is originally $17 and I get it for $2.99. I just thought it was really cute and really funny. This is like the holy grail of amazingness. Do I have everything? I think so. So I walked up and my mom and I was like, oh, I wonder if they have like coffee table books. They probably don't have like Harry Potter or anything. And my mom was like, we'll see. Like she, and then my mom looked up and she saw this thing that said like coffee table books. It was amazing. They, it literally said coffee table books. So I did get, I think, one or two that were in that section and I'll show you. I think this was in that section. This was originally $30, which it was originally $30. I get it for $5.99. This is from the films of Harry Potter, Creatures, a paper scene book. And it even says $29.99. I can confirm because I check out all the Harry Potter books and I spent so much money on Harry Potter books. So when I saw these, I was like, Ah, my favorite actress in the whole world. Don't tell me that she's a bad person because it'll just break my heart. I watched like a TikTok thing that Guy Fieri was a jerk. Uh, like people who've worked with celebrities and they like rate them on a scale of zero to 10. And I think they rated him a zero and said he was really mean. And it broke my heart because we love uh, drive it. I don't know how to say that y'all. Uh, drive-ins, dines, and dives. You know what I'm talking about. Drive-through 
diamonds and dives. I don't know. You guys know. Triple D. There you go. And my husband and I love to watch that. So we're like, he can't be mean. But please don't tell me if Reese Witherspoon is mean because she's my favorite actress in the whole world. I think that she's so awesome. She's like my perfect cup of tea. And I just don't want her to be mean. In my head, she's just as sweet as she is on Legally Blonde. But I had this book to put on my um, bookshelves in my Amazon cart. And I think it was like 2432. And I had it in my cart and I just kept not pulling the trigger and kept not pulling the trigger. When I saw it there, I, like it, there was just lights around it. I was so excited. And this was $25 their price, wherever you sold it. And uh, their price was $5.99. And it says whiskey in a teacup. And I thought that was so adorable. And this is the back. And I think that it has, oh, look at the inside. I think that it has a lot of uh, like things she wrote, but I also think it is um, like recipes and stuff. So I think she wrote about her, but then she wrote about dinner parties. There's recipes in there. I just thought this was super, super cool and I'm so excited and I'm actually going to read it and it's just not going to be a total coffee table book. Next up is another Harry Potter. It is J.K. Rowling's Wizarding World Movie Magic. This is what the front looks like. And it was $29.99 and I get it for $4.99, $5. How amazing is that? Oh, this inside. Oh, I kind of, it messed up a little bit. But my stepdad painted this and I'm going to frame it and put it in my room. Isn't that so pretty? I was like, I love that. And he's like, you can have it. And I said, what? But I did, I took it and I'll frame it. Isn't that awesome? I just love it. Anyway, this is really cool because it has um, like the behind the scenes and it shows all the different animals. And I think this is mostly Fantastic Beast. It does have Dobby in it. It does have the Phoenix. Uh, it does have the Cornish Pixies, but I think a lot of it is from Fantastic Beast. Well, part one is anyway. Okay, let's see if we can get to, it has stickers. How cool is that? It has like pop-ups. It's actually a very, very nice book. So if you guys, and they had a giant kids section too. So if you need anything for kids, it is so inexpensive. Look at Hedwig. Oh, I just love it so much. Okay, enough about that. This next book I eyed at Target for so long and I just didn't want to spend the money on it. And part of the reason why I loved it so much is because the noise that it makes, it's covered with plastic, which is like the, all books were bound in like the hard covered books were bound in that like plastic when I went to the library when I was younger and at school. And so it brings back so many memories. This is Stranger Things World Turned Upside Down. And it has that like plastic and I just love it so much. And it says, don't freak, this book is supposed to look worn and torn. So they made it look like an old library book, which I think is so cool. And then the synopsis, uh, I think even the inside has stains all over it. Like it's supposed to be like that. And then it says condition fair. Oh, that's so cute. I wish I could read. Oh, this is the foreword. I just got to read to you the first little paragraph because it cracks me up. It says, do you copy? This book is for nerds. I repeat, this book is for nerds. So if you're reading this right now, congratulations, you're a nerd. Watching our nerdy show apparently wasn't enough for you. You wanted, scratch that, needed to know how it was made, which is the kind of thought process we love. And it's why we as fellow nerds, we're so excited when we were told about this making of book. So it's the making of Stranger Things. What a cool read this is going to be. This was $4.99 from $36. And I think that it was $36 and like 30% off. So it's still 20 something dollars at Target. And when I saw this, I was so, so excited. So 
I have one more thing, but swear if you guys have an Ollie's around you, even like a half an hour away and you get to go somewhere else and make like a mini trip out of it, their book selection is so good. I'm not saying it's like a Barnes and Noble's worth. It is still a small store, but I feel like their selection is amazing. They have fiction, nonfiction, cooking. Um, they have biographical. They have like aviation, war, um, all kinds of puzzles, adult coloring books, adult puzzles, and then a giant kid section. Just go through the kid section if you are a reader like I am, because a lot of the Harry Potter stuff and this too, which this is like quite a book for a little kid. Like the, the writing is tiny, so this would be quite a book for them to read. But all of these books were in the like teen little kid section. Not all of them, but a lot of them. So go through the kid section as well. Last but not least, when I saw this, I just couldn't say no. You all know I love Disney. And this is The Art of Walt Disney's Mickey and Minnie Mouse. And it comes in this like case. Isn't that so pretty? And it's literally just tons and tons of pictures of Mickey and Minnie and how they were made. And it's a two book set. So if you look here, one is Minnie and one is Mickey. Are you seeing that? I know my ring light's really bad. It's at night, so I have the ring light on and then I have another light filtering behind it and my overhead light or else it would be not bright enough in here. Uh, let me see if this says says, one of Walt Disney's most favorite quotes is, I only hope that we never lose sight of one thing, that it was all started by a mouse. More exact, it was all started by two mice, Mickey and Minnie Mouse. And then it tells you all about how they came about, all the pictures, how cool is this? Anyway, this was 50 doll hairs, y'all, 50 big ones. And I got it for $7.99, so, I will never doubt you again, mom, when you tell me to go somewhere and you were right. That's all y'all. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Bye guys.